Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh Dear students As we already saw How act 2 Ended In the previous video Now we are moving into Act 3 In the first scene In Act 3 Moscow appeared alone On the stage and the street the grammatical device used in here is called the soliloquy as you already uh, know if you go back into the essential literary terms I already gave you in the first term you will find the definition of soliloquy. Ben Johnson was a very obviously showed us two types of character, two types of people in this play. Characters who are mentally fooled and characters who are physically fooled. Mosca played Fooled by choice, by his own choice. In the second scene, which is also about the character sketch of Moscow, here Moscow talked to Binario. Binario was the son of Gerbasho the old man and Pinario seemed very good fellow he disbelieved Mosca but Mosca was very clever to convince him that his father Garpaccio will disinherit him He convinced him by even weeping. He started weeping, Moscow. And he told him that he comes in the sake of Binario. Now he told him that his father will disinherit him and will give the fortune into Valpo and now he is offering his hand to help Binari Mosca he wants to get rid of Corpaccio by his own son this happened because both Valpo and Moscow wants to add Celia to their treasure. Scene 3 took place in Valpon house where Valpons was sitting there and he watched Nano Castron entertain him. Before the end of this scene there is also a knock and the knock here in this play there is an introduction for new character but this time it is Lady Politic would be on the, the door scene 4 where the lady comes to chat with Valpon I mean the lady would be Valpon pretends to be very sick he cannot hear he wants to get rid of the lady but in this scene Mosca is not in the mansion of Valpo in scene 5 Mosca dismissed the lady lady would be from the scene where Mosca 
came late in scene number four. He is the only one who was able to run the plots of Valpon. Now it is the time that Carbaccio arrived to Valpon's house with a wall. In the wall, there should be Garbaccio inherit all his fortune to Valpon for the sake of getting Valpon's satisfaction. So, on the other hand, Valpon will write will write a will with the benefit for the old man. But Moscow brought Bernario into this scene. He will let him to hide and to listen into his father talk and also to the will. Then Bernardo will move in action toward his father and he will kill his father. There is another knock in this scene. Mosca was expecting the rage of Corbacho but on the door isn't Corbacho but Vino and Celia where where this scene scene number seven is representing the climax of this play again for the definition of the climax check the essential literal terms and you will know about the climax so here in scene number seven Corvino hasted his action to win the fortune of Valpen instead of Valtor or Garbaccio and now Mosca he should move towards Benario so he told him to move into the gallery where there are many books to read and entertain himself till his father come but Benario became very suspicious of the act of Moscow Corvino was very greedy to bring Celia into Valpon's house. He forced her into Valpon's house. He threatens her. He wants her to be obedient wife and to listen to his instruction. She described him as a sinful man. She asked for his jealousy. What happened to Corvino that he totally changed? Mosca, now on the other hand, convinced Corvino to leave the house. Now here, there is a very important incident happen, which is the turning point of our discipline, where Valpon desire changed from gold into women. Valpon seized Celia but out of there there is Bernario who hear the cry of Celia she, she wants someone to help her so Bernario leaped out for the sake of Celia for saving Celia and this action will ascend the other actions toward the resolution of this uh, play. And he talked Celia and he went out. In scene number eight, Mosca appeared wounded. He was bleeding because Benario wants to kill Valpone but he hit 
mask. When Johnson was very clever by making his audience predict what will happen next. This technique is called suspense. Also you will find the definition of the suspense in the essential literary terms. Suspense it is about the question what will happen next. Now in scene 9 Mosca told Gorbachev that his son knew about the world. He even tried to kill Valpon. Then because Valpons were right, his fortune for you, he will be the only heir. Now Walter comes from behind. He heard the talk of Mosca and Gorbachev. He accused Mosca of playing him for the sake of Gorbachev but Moscow told Valtor that everything goes for his benefit I mean here that Valtor will not only get the fortune of Balpon but also of Gorbachev because Valtor is a lawyer now he will accuse Celia and Pinayo to attempt of the killing of Valpon. As we will see in Act 4, thank you very much.